Hello once again YouTube land. My name is Kestel Caden and we are playing the Walking Dead game. We're starting now on chapter 2. So, a lot happened obviously. I know who you are. I got Watch another out. good one for you. For those that haven't actually seen this, please check my channel for the first uh, chapter. Because yeah. this would probably be a bit of a spoiler you, for you guys. You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. Doug and I'm died. Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. When you got it, boss. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. With or without you. He wasn't actually Protecting bitten. my kid with my life. <laughs> Bye bye, Doug. Oh my god. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. He's an asshole. Just stating the obvious, I guess. But I mean, he's an asshole. And as you can see on the screen, the game does adapt to the choices that you do make. So when you try to side with some people, the other side of that side will kind of be mad at you to say the least. And I mean, you have to keep in mind that you have to try to keep you the best interests of the girl in mind when making decisions. So it really does depend on how you play the game. Like, I've seen quite a few different things, outcomes I should say. I wonder how long I could do this. Now you know what, I'm gonna just go for it. Sorry Zomzom. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> Guess well, they can't have that's that one. Another meal lost. New guy, apparently. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Hmm. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. So the new character's oh, name's Mark, oh. obviously. No kidding. That's an interesting way to try to introduce a person three months when past I asked and grabbed for you know. Carly's rations the other night. I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Food yeah, is low. You're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Um I guess we'll have to ask Lily. You'll have to ask Lily. She's the one handling the rations. Or miss him. Ah, uh, I don't kid. like Lily. He's just worried about his kid getting enough. I worry about Clementine, too. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? Let's hope I so. I sure hope so. Oh, that was close. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. So you that's know, probably another choice you guys are going to have to probably make. RV running. Um, Kenny won't Kenny be banned at us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? He's an asshole. Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Asshole. Kill the birdie. Um, let's see. He's just looking out for his daughter. I might as well be nice. Looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take True. that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. Lily and I know intimidates Lily me. thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. Hmm. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Hmm. I definitely don't like Larry or Lily. If you can't tell. Really? That's a waste of a bullet. Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really frickin' hungry. I bet. What now? Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! I don't know if that sounded like Kenny or not.
That doesn't sound like any. Nope. Random strangers. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Damn. Travis, maybe they can help. That These looks might like be the hurts. same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us he go. He seems We're paranoid. Not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this Holy is Kenny. Up. We've gotta help him. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Not just really. See if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We'll try. We gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. <laughs> hurry, please, hurry. Probably attracting walkers like no other. With all this screaming. The trap's been altered. There's no release lights. That sucks. Oh no. Zombie bait trap, I guess. Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. This can't be happening. Okay. Let's go for the chain. Yeah, I know. Go for the chain. That barely budged. The ground is probably too soft or something. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not gonna work. Okay. Is he? Let's go. Is he gonna make it? I'm not gonna be able to cut down a whole freaking tree. Come on. Oh, oh, yeah, no, nope, not to gonna now. happen. Uh, you have to get him out. You have to. There's gotta be. Uh, well, if Dad, this doesn't you work. No, no, no. We don't Stop. have time for that. Come on, do oh, something. We have to go now. Well, sorry, bud. I tried. Uh, chop, chop time. Oh God. I'm gonna have to cut you out. No, no, no. It's keep the only way. Try the trap again. Anything, please. The release hatch is well. Oh, I can't go back to it. Oh god. Fuck, I'm just wasting ammo now. We got to go. Sorry, buddy. <gasps> I said I was sorry, man. Oh, that's gruesome. Sorry, buddy, man. It's the only way. I don't want to watch this, but I have to because it's like right there. Oh. That oh looked painful. Shit. Is he? He passed out. Bleeding. Pick him up and go. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Damn. That's all I gotta say. Just damn. Run. Behind you, Travis. Come on, come on, we gotta move! Run! Dad was in Special Forces, my ass. Don't curl up into a ball. He curled up into a ball. But damn, that's a good intro. Holy damn, that's a good intro. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is... Chapter 2. Holy damn. The Trevelier Motel. Yeah, I know, I said I'd only say Traveler Motel. Whatever. New chapter, new... whatever. Looks like they barricaded it nicely, though. They even found some crayons, apparently. She looks tired. Probably a little annoyed. Mostly tired. And smiling now. Hmm. Well. Zombie? That's gotta be distracting. Well, at least they have a system. 
Hallo. Get the gates ah. open. We've got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Come on, saving come on. people, apparently. What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's that? going on? I don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him so many truck. voices. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. So many subtitles. What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. That was a he tough choice. Died if we left him. So what? We are Assholes. not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. There come you go, on, Carly. Billy. These are people. People exactly. trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. Damn. I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> welcome to the family, kid. Warm welcome for their sure. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Oh, Clementine. Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. <laughs> A little. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. So. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to bitch. have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. But now that it's running out, uh, must suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules. <sighs> nice. But you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. I did Look, save somebody's once life. Once Catcher patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. Damn straight. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize <laughs> that I make these decisions uh. to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, Calm please. down, Pops. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Go punch a tree. You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. She's pissy. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Ouch. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. She's a bitch. But then again, she does have to make some hard decisions, so I guess that kind of goes with the territory, plus her military side, plus... I mean, look at her father. So, we only have four items. Interesting. Okay, so Mark was extremely hungry. We have the kids, plus maybe Carly. There's Kenny. There's so many people who I have to feed. This isn't fair. So many people. Okay. Um. I know I have to give one to Clementine. I'm sorry, but it's just the way it is. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Oh, she lost her hat. Sure. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Interesting random event. However, I will go talk to her again just to see what she's going on about. Uh, okay, well, there's, I guess there's not too much. She probably still has the walkie-talkie, and uh, I already asked how she was doing. Well, no. Let's just how ask. How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? Um, lie to the girl, or just... Uh, okay, you I'm know. I'm not sure. I hope he will. I'm so hungry, Lee. I 
hope I get to eat soon. Okay, how can I say no to her? Like, seriously? Uh, I'm sorry. Even if I wanted to. No, she gets food. I don't care. Even if she was full, I'm going to give her food. Yeah, With that yeah, face exactly. and all those expressions and etc, etc. Okay, half an apple, piece of jerky, give crackers and cheese. Let's give her crackers and cheese. Okay, a Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> har, har. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? <laughs> yes, yes, Duck, you too, I guess. Uh, well, first I guess I'll talk to you him a little bit. You were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Hmm. How you doing, Duck? How you doing, Duck? Oh, I'm wow. okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is. A cat. I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. It looked like a cat. Hey, Duck. How about a little food? Wow, his expression. I'm just going to stare at this for a little bit. Oh, he stopped. Oh, there it is. Aw. Ah. Aw. Okay, I'm done. I will give him crackers and cheese. Here. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm so hungry. Can I feed myself? Uh, nope. Okay. Let's see. I will talk to Ben. Hey, is my friend going to make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. Go, Kaja. I can't you chopped off his leg. I had no, no choice. Way. It's either that or so. Who are Let you? Let him people? die. Our group's gonna want to know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. Hello, the man Ben you Paul. you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when, when everything happened. Life went to hell, did it? How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, um, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know. Use words. Something. Spit it out. Uh, you did all you could. I'm sure you I'll did be nice all to you him. could. Yeah, maybe. Want some food? Want something to eat? Half an apple or a piece of jerky? Nah. He doesn't look that hungry. If your camp got raided, probably means you haven't eaten in a while. I am really hungry. Thanks. I don't care if it's an unpopular choice. Uh, okay, I'm sure there might be some benefit to this, but I'm going to give it to somebody oh, else. Some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Okay, well, there we have that. Who's the last person? Oh, Mark. He was the one who was extremely Will you hold hungry. the damn board steady? I'm trying. Oh, I, goody. I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Sigh. I would have considered Larry because of his heart condition or whatever, but in reality, he's an asshole. So I'm going to give it to Mark. Here, eat something. Half an apple. You got you an apple. Wow, thanks a lot. That's that's awesome. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Hmm. Oh, come on. Does everything have to boil down to a choice? Larry could probably utilize it better, but I hate Larry, but this is so conflicting. Uh, come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, whatever. Here, Mark, this should help. I might as well stay consistent. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? I did. Come on. You're just man. an asshole. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... <laughs> Oh, That's right, old man. I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cry. So now you're all apologetic and all this other crap. Thanks. Well, Lily, I did your bidding. Stop being so mean. Not such an easy job, is it? No. 
Pouty Lee is pouty. Oh, it's I forgot okay. to feed her. I know you're still watching out for me. Damn. Oops. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice. But oh, you I didn't know I could have kids. fed Kenny. That's what a real man does. Damn it again. Thanks, Kenny. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. I don't You're care. You're out! What happened to my food? You're being an asshole There's to me. There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Hmm. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. Aw. God damn it. That sucks. I'm getting sick of this shit. At least we Ken, got the new guy. Back. There's nothing. I don't. Okay. What? What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. Sorry, I had that a bit of frame drop there. Brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? We'll hold on to him. What? Holy hell. The axe! Hurry! What the Oh, okay. Bashy bashy. Move, move. Shit, it's stuck! Noob. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay. Okay, mm that's disgusting. Thank you, Carly. You're my friend. You okay? Uh, Thanks. Uh, uh, Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, uh, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Uh, Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He uh, was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your uh, not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking what? about? It's not the bite that does it. Oh, really? You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. Ouch. We're all infected? Damn. Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Damn. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. That's up. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Hello, Me and my people. brother, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. Uh, we don't want any trouble. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected Car? by an electric fence. Oh, generators that provide the electricity. Damn. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If, if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Really? Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. Good idea. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Good idea. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? I think I'm gonna go. But, uh, yeah, this has been Castle Caden. 
I have been playing The Walking Dead. We are on Chapter 2. I hope you guys have enjoyed so far. Please leave a comment down below. Tell me if I've made any stupid choices. Uh, subscribe to me. That definitely helps me out. And give me a like. All of those three above will definitely help out this channel, and it will make me continue to be happy and make more videos for you guys. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, this is Kestel Caden, signing off.